Hi, Tony Manis here for 5 of Supply, and this one minute, one point lesson is on TrueTray. TrueTray is a revolutionary product that allows you to customize your tool storage needs. The TrueTray system includes molding material, impression solution, and optional top coat. Let me show you how it works. Before you get started, you want to prepare your work area. Have a well ventilated area, cover your work surface, and you might even want to have goggles and gloves. The beauty of TrueTray is that it allows for any type of tools, specific equipment like gauges, or even high cost items like torque wrenches. A word of caution, when you're working with the impression material, it's easy to leave marks, but the marks are also easy to get rid of. If you make a mark in an unintended area, just lightly rub over it and fill it back in. To start the process, lay your item down on the impression material, and then lightly start to press it in, working it back and forth. A tip for when you're putting in items, you might want to make it easy to reach in and grab them. So just use your thumb or another type of material to leave a little area to make it easier to grab. And then continue on with all of the rest of your items in the order that you want to place them. If there's anything that needs to be pressed down, just smooth it out with your finger. If you have an item that you want to protect from the dust, an easy way to do that is just to wrap it in plastic before you put it down. Once you have your layout complete, the next step is to use the molding solution. Recommend by starting with the back of the sheet first. Go ahead and spray the back of the impression material with the molding spray in an overlapping pattern. Don't forget to spray the sides of the molding material, but leave a spot open for your fingers so that you can flip it over. After you spray the back of the impression material with the molding spray, use this included stands to hold it up so you can work on the top. Spray the molding solution in a sweeping pattern and overlap a little bit. As the molding solution soaks in, Go ahead and spray it a second or even a third time. Allow the tray to dry for 12 to 24 hours. The tray will harden as it dries. After the tray is dry, you can top it off with another coat of the True Tray Solution to give it a nice gloss hardened look or use the optional top coat. You can customize True Tray for any application. You can make a carrying case with magnets to hold those very precious items. You can even use true tray inside of cases to protect those valuable items or include things like velvet or other protective materials. You can customize your look by using the top coat paint or any paint that would adhere to plastic. Organize and protect your tools and investments with true tray. Get true tray and other tool organization items at 5S Supply.